Mina san konnichiwa, this is David. And Mina. And tonight we are opening up the HG Gundam the Origin RTX 65 gun tank early type. <laughs> Easy for you to say. Yeah, so this is um, this is the gun tank that um, cast of all pilots and, um, you know, a bunch of um, Xeon troops, I guess. But, um, or not Xeon troops, uh, Federation. Federation troops, sorry. Um, and... Of course, Castball does a lot of great, cool stuff in it. Um, here's our art. Now, of course, this is a lot different than our gun tank that anyone who is familiar with Mobile Suit Gundam um, would know. Looks lovely to me. I think that it's a big improvement, but it's not very hard to improve upon the gun tank because the gun tank is kind of shit. <laughs> now, how do you really feel? All right, so... first bag we get a nice set of stickers here these are the um, sticker style decals um, just like the Zaku has on it let's see if we can get focused in there these are pretty nice little detailed stickers they're gonna do a whole bunch of good to a kit like this as long as there's enough light colored space to put it on okay our treads this is an HG kit we are not expecting a lot of mobility this um, these treads are solid they are not yeah. going anywhere yeah. Um, but, you know, what did we expect? It's nice canister pieces there. Zero Cool is um, screaming in the background. Sorry. Our second bag here. <clears throat> We're going to have all of our little... Um, Rotor joints there, polycaps, and more of those because, um, of course, it's symmetrical. We have our little face green piece here, just a single single piece. Uh, we have a sort of silverish um, arm piece here. This is, uh, I guess, the, the soft part, supposedly, um, on the arms. And we've got the bulk of our body here. The um, I will note that the torso is two pieces. They're very big pieces. Um, could probably use some detailing. Um, and by probably, I mean you really want to do some detailing if you want it to look good. Um, but... Zero Cool disagrees. Yeah, Zero Cool disagrees. He's he's upset. Um, and then the body of the tank here, two very big plates. Um, again, again, paint. You're going to want to paint this thing um, if you want to even display it. Um, it's a very gray piece otherwise. Um, and then there's the sides. But that's it. It's actually a really simple kit, it looks like. Let's see what the instruction booklet looks like. Yeah, the the um, the display is way way more colored than mm -hmm. the um, actual kit, um, so that's definitely something that I think that they expect for you here. Um, it is going to assemble a little bit differently because, of course, it has treads, but it's a pretty simple build. These are all really big pieces, so this should be maybe maybe a half hour build. Like this is a this is a real easy type kit um i wouldn't be surprised if we ended up seeing something like this in mg maybe but um as it stands this is it's it's really simple i think it's gonna look good i don't know i haven't put it together yet i've only seen painted pictures of them yet so far um so i'm gonna put this together do a review of it and um hopefully it lives up to the awesomeness of its um position in the movie um, if you haven't already heard from our other openings, um, we are pushing back our contest because of um, some bureaucratic nonsense with Japan. Um, so we've been very busy. And, um, yeah, matane, everyone. Matane!